a 120-meter dive first thing in the morning. That's how bridge inspector and engineer Zahid Salahadinov starts his workday. I'm originally from Uzbekistan, came to the United States in 2015 when I got accepted to University of Nebraska Omaha in College of Civil and Architectural Engineering. Getting a job in the U.S. isn't easy for international students, mainly because of the long, difficult process to get a work visa. But as an engineer, Salahadinov was confident he would find work easily, since his skills are in high demand in the U.S. And he was right. Two years ago, I graduated with a bachelor's degree in civil engineering and accepted a job offer from a startup company here in Denver, Colorado called Engineering Operations. Our company offers uh, bridge design and inspection services. But engineering is just part of the job. The requirements also mandate that Salahadinov be able to climb and dive, essential skills for bridge inspectors. Some bridges require specialty inspection, uh, which includes uh, rope access or underwater inspection. One of the most recent examples uh, of inspection that our company has done would be Blue Mesa Water Reservoir, uh, located in Colorado. Uh, it required um, a deep dive up to 120 meters. Not a lot of companies uh, can offer these services in the United States, which uh, makes our industry unique. Uh, many uh, engineers out there, but not all of them have uh, climbing or underwater diving experience. But Salahadinov's job can also be dangerous. One of the main um, problems that may occur to a diver is a decompression sickness when dissolved gases, um, including nitrogen, come out of the solution in bubbles and may affect um, uh, divers uh, uh, Body. Another skill Salahadinov needs in his job is flying drones. He so fell in love with that part of his work that flying drones has become his hobby. We also use drones for our inspections, especially when the bridge is on high elevation. This aspect of my job influenced me to start my uh, hobby, which is uh, drone cinematography. A unique collection of skills that brought Salahadinov not only a job, but a hobby, a passion and a new way to look at life. For Svetlana Pristinska in Denver, Colorado, NRI's VOA News.